got home half an hour late. And Lizzie was already at the door waiting for me. Her eyes were so big, and as she was looking at me, she asked me where I'd been. And I wasn't sure what to tell her. I mean, the truth would confuse her, but lying to her would break my heart. So I just said, Daddy got held up at work again, honey. My wife, Julie, was unloading the groceries, and when she gave me that look, she just stared straight through me. She knew exactly what I'd been doing. When we went inside, I took off my shoes and my coat, and that's, that's when the guilt just started to attack me. It started at my feet and went up my spine. Then I thought about what I'd been doing just, just an hour before, waiting in the parking lot for my son Mickey to show up, just so I could give him the money that he'd been begging me and my wife for for, for the past few weeks. Julie begged me not to give it to him. Don't give it to him. he just buy, buy drugs with it. But he's my son. He didn't even say a word. He just he stared at the ground as he took the money. And then he turned and walked away. I don't know if or when I'll ever hear from him again. He only calls us when he's desperate. And Julie didn't talk to me the rest of the night, and I don't blame her. I feel so guilty just thinking that he's out there somewhere getting high because of me. Because of me. But I'm just praying that he'll change. I'm his father. There's always hope.